Suction leak force calculation. On the other hand, how much weight can be lifted by using a suction lift? Now, as you can see in this figure, let me get my pen. So atmospheric pressure is coming from all sides. It's not just this way, it's also coming from everywhere. This way, this way, this way. Now, it is, um, so if we create a uh, vacuum here, then the force acting this direction is basically uh, the vacuum uh, pressure or suction pressure times this area. And then from the bottom side, there is higher pressure. The atmospheric pressure is high. So there is higher forces from the uh, bottom side, so which can be calculated as. So this F is basically P of atmospheric pressure times the area of the, um, the outside of that cup. So basically, uh, this area we are talking about. As you can see it in the bottom uh, picture uh, here. Now, and then the downward force is basically F equals P suction uh, times the, the inside area, which is AI. And then if you subtract those two force, then the resultant force will be the amount of load in theory can be lifted, uh, something like that. So this is the suction lift force calculation. Everything else is kind of um, follows the all uh, usual uh, terminology.